And the city of Beaver Creek is bracing for some big crowds at a local bowling alley. After 50 weeks without a winner, someone will be cashing in on more than a million dollars at the final Queen of Hearts drawing on Monday, and they're expecting a huge crowd. Two News reporter Grace Hewitt joins us live from Beaver View Bowl, asking questions about the safety plan. Grace? Hey, Brooke and John, it's been busy here all day today at Beaver View Bowl, and that's only expected to grow as we approach Monday night's drawing. I saw people lined up at 1130 this morning just to get their hands on some raffle tickets, and some of those folks are coming from out of state just to try their luck. The raffle started with a full deck last July. Since then, 49 people have flipped a card, but none have uncovered the Queen of Hearts. It is exciting. Um, I heard that people come up here, they stand out. Usually there's a very long line and um, it could be like an hour wait. With the final draw Monday and more than a million dollars on the line, the serious cash is drawing concern about safety. I was actually nervous about that um, because like any person that gets drawn, you know, you have to have somebody with you. I think it's important because, you know, it's a lot of money. You don't want to get like robbed. Or After the last drawing on June 26, there were complaints filed about overcrowding and occupancy at the bowling alley. Beaverview Bowling issued a statement saying they will monitor and limit the number of people in the building for this drawing. The Beaver Creek Fire Prevention Bureau will also be on site to ensure the occupancy limit is not exceeded and that exits remain clear in case of emergencies. Now, the city of Beaver Creek says that police will be out on Monday to help maintain traffic and ensure a safe experience for all. The draw will be Monday night at 8 p.m. Live in Beaver Creek, Grace Hewitt, 2 News.